Hey everybody, this is Fat Cat Paul Ann, and here we go with another episode. This is episode 17 of the One Sim, One Object Challenge. This sim actually has three objects, but it's all one unit. We've got a computer, a desk, and a chair. That's the only way you can use a computer. So this sim is going to have five minutes. They've got $100, and they are going to try to see how much money they can make in five minutes of real time. I've got my phone set for five minutes. And we are going to be video gaming. I already tried using a computer, and I think when I did that, I mean, it's been a couple of weeks, you guys. <laughs> I don't know if I remember. I think we just tried everything we could do with the computer, like we wrote a book and we did hacking and all that stuff. But this sim is going to play video games and hopefully live stream, play game. We're going to get in tournaments. Um, I'm not sure if we can even live stream. Let me look at that. Watch live stream. But we're going to try to get good at video games so that we can win a tournament. So I'm going to look at all of these. Probably the best way to make money. <laughs> would be to use the computer to get a job, but we're going to ignore that, and we're going to play games. <laughs> I feel, I'm feel feeling this is going to go very badly for her. I did buy the cheapest desk, the cheapest, one of the cheapest chairs, and um, a really cheap computer in case we, we have to sell those. I mean, it wouldn't be fair if I had, at the beginning, bought the 10,000 Somalian computer and then sold that to... Um, make money. <laughs> we we all know I can build a house for 10,000 simoleons. We know I can. Um, so I'm hoping that the, okay, I'm going to have her continue, hopefully, to be a pro at Blitbok. I don't know if it's fair, if it makes any difference if you concentrate on one game for self to play Blick Block. <laughs> That's one I have not seen before. I have never forced a Sim to play video games. So I think that's funny. <laughs> okay, we can enter a game tournament. Enter novice game tournament. I mean, we'll win some money. Let's go ahead and enter. She moves around a lot when she plays. <laughs> I don't know how much I move when I play, so I, I can't be critical. <laughs> I like that she moves her feet too. Okay, she's not good, she did not win. But let's try again. Oh, she can't. Another game tournament will be held soon. Nice. I don't want to spend any money on um, buying her a bush. So I'm going to take a little look-see around. I haven't played here before. Honestly, not a lot ever. I need to move her roof. I don't, is the roof covering her? Just to make sure, in case it rains, I, you never know. Um, we're not doing well. I, I felt like it wouldn't go well. Then I got encouraged. I'm going to have her um, practice programming until... Oh, wait. Now she can enter the other tournament. Let's enter the Blick Block tournament again. Oh, shoot. I get so annoyed. I annoy myself so badly. <laughs> <laughs> I told her to stop and then I had to pay another $10 uh, that is what happens when you do everything really fast and really recklessly which is how I completely how I run my life so um, it does well for me in my professional life because I'm very fast um, at my job but it, it doesn't do well in most everything else because I'm too fast, too impulsive 
<laughs> At least a couple of people in my house have ADHD, and I may also. <laughs> I may be one of them. <laughs> uh, hmm. She can't program. She can't enter a tournament, but she can practice. Her video game skill gets up. We'll see how much time she has left. She has no money. She has no money. Um, she has not won a tournament, and um, she can't. And she has five seconds left. And the only thing I can do is sell what she has and try to buy her a house. <laughs> That's the saddest thing. Um, it's, And they have depreciated, so... We have $954. I can't really even build much of anything with that. As you guys know, if you've been watching, do I want to build another roof house here? $954. The sadness of it. It's a nice location, though. Look at that. It's really beautiful. I think maybe... I will build a roof house because walls are just so pricey. I'm going to do one of these right on top of her just for fun. And um, I'm going to try to make the roof look like that. I'll be right back. Okay, I watched a tutorial from Little Simsy. And she said to use Shift C and it will allow you to get these extra buttons. I don't know that that's helping me. <laughs> Shift C. Well, hmm. I mean, we all know what this house is going to look like. We all know, basically, I mean, that's a little bit of a slightly, maybe, different shape than I've done before. <laughs> I've done the Hobbit house, though. Okay, well, there it is. It's going to annoy the neighbors <laughs> in this neighborhood. They're going to be like, what is that? Maybe it'll become a tourist attraction. Um, you know, the bazaar house. I'm going to put some of the siding that goes with this world and some of the roofing that goes with this world. I don't feel like that's black, as black as this, what they have. Hmm, I don't know what they have over there. Anyway, um, I'm going to, I'm going to work on this, you know, it's going to have to have, let's see what kind of door. They just have a very plain, boring door. I don't really want that. I want an interesting, cheap door. And an interesting window. All right, let's do our same old, same old that we've been doing for, not the basement, the same thing what we've been doing for everybody. Construction quality concrete. I don't think we done a black floor well, you know it's fine it's fine I'm not, I don't know if I'm gonna give her walls we'll see I would really like to give her a shower I feel so sorry for them when they can't have a shower you know But they're so pricey, as we have discussed. They are so pricey. This would take every bit of my money that I really want it. But I won't do it. I'll give her a stupid-looking kid's bed. I'm not going to put it in her urine, though. things my sims go through it's just not it's just not inhumane it really is but she has a snack bag she has books she has a silly looking children's bed and she has a fully functional bathroom it would be nice if I could get her garbage 
and I can. So there you go. Y you make no money. <laughs> you make zero money. Well, I mean, you know, if we had some more time, we could have made some money, but we didn't. We had this time, this amount of time. Um, I'm going to throw some debug trees out here for her and um, call this a day. And I will see you next time, I guess. Let me do the trees and I'll come. I'll, I'll show you. Hang on. Okay, I'm back. I tried to make it look like it blended into the neighborhood and I don't think I did too awfully bad. All of this stuff that I added is debug and it's 90% debug from Cottage Living. I made a little patio in the back with some, looks like they're kind of a planty sim. And um, um, I'm going to... I'm going to check and see if any of these things that I got that light up in the game, if the debug versions light up. So bear with me. Oh, they do. They glow a little bit. I got some lights here and there. Um, some candles. So she's got her bed. She's got um, toilet bathroom. It's right here in the open. I could go and get that screen that I got the other day, but you know, you've seen that. You've You've been there. You've done that. You've seen me do that. So we're just going to leave it like this, and I'm going to let her go to the bathroom, take a shower, and be happy before I leave her. <laughs> and I'll see you next time. Bye.